Hello, hello, hello. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Free Script series. I know it's been a really long time since I last posted any free add-on and I'm really sorry about that. I was busy with some other projects, but this weekend I had some free time, so I decided to tackle this issue with AutoSmooth in Blender 4.1. A lot of people are not happy with the way it works now because Blender has changed it from being a toggle to now being a geometry nodes modifier that you have to add to every object and then make sure that modifier stays at the bottom of the modifier stack for proper shading. And to fix that I made this add-on called Old Auto Smooth and this tries to mimic the behavior from older Blender versions. So without wasting any more time, let's open up Blender and see how it works. So here I've got both Blender 4.0 and 4.1 running. Let's see how Auto Smooth used to work in Blender 4.0. You would simply right click and use Shade Auto Smooth and you are done. You could add then any modifiers you want and it will automatically update the shading like this. But in Blender 4.1 you will find that option is missing. And they have this new shade smooth by angle but this is a destructive way of shading which we don't want so let's undo that the new method is to use this normal smooth by angle modifier you first need to shade smooth and now you get the same results but if you add any other modifier let's say we add bevel just like 4.0 you will see these results are not same and to get the same results you will need to move this modifier to the bottom of the stack now if you have multiple objects multiple modifier you are in new modifiers this can get pretty annoying having to move this to the bottom every time and that is exactly where this add-on comes in all you have to do is simply enable it and it will automatically keep it at the bottom so let's try it on another object that sh shades auto smooth OES which is old auto smooth now if I add any other modifiers I'm using this tag presets from my random tool add-on you will see it automatically updates it and moves it to the bottom you also get this normal span effect and you can toggle auto smooth from here it does the same thing now if you add any other modifier let's say add level and you will see it automatically keeps it at the bottom so that's basically it for the add-on it's available for free on my gumroad and for one dollar on my blender market store the links for it are in the description below so please go check them out and i'll see you in the next one